My name is Professor Allison and I'm from the University of Liverpool. Our research funded project is called the Birkenhead Drill and we are running a live exercise in late September which will be a multi-agency exercise. Uh, we're looking at a number of things uh, from a research perspective. First of all we're looking at decision making from command to tactical to operational. Uh, we are looking at inertia, decision inertia, so the things that cause decision inertia and the extent to which expertise and experience can override decision inertia. The second thing that we're looking at is multi-agency communication. So we have a interrogation suite, interview and interrogation suite, where we, we will be interviewing role players that are playing the role of terrorists. We will be looking at the effectiveness of those interrogations and the extent to which information from them spreads through that network and how it can be used to save lives on the ground. The third thing that we're looking at is casualty behaviour. So in the exercise that we're running, which is a big live exercise with three sites on a tube train, it's a, uh, it's a constructed tube train uh, where we have a number of casualties that will uh, undergo a decontamination procedure because they will have been attacked in the role play scenario uh, by a chemical weapon. And we're looking at the effectiveness of that decontamination procedure and also the views of those casualties that are playing those roles in relation to how they were treated by the emergency services. The overall objective of our research is to increase the efficacy of decision making, to look at the efficiency and effectiveness of live exercises to train people and accelerate their expertise, and third of all, the effectiveness and efficiency of interrogation behaviours that we've looked at in the past in terms of rapport-based strategies to extract information from people. And our research was funded by the Crest organisation and for more information please see the Crest website.